All right, so I saw this on my Facebook page today, and and uh, this is a post for from a guy who screenshotted a video about a YouTuber who's probably from the Philippines, and he made a video about. YouTube changing a new monetization in 2021. Yeah, you heard that right. New YouTube monetization in 2021. As part of the YouTube Partner Program. Now, this is the guy's YouTube channel named Leon, Leon, Leomar Balin. I don't know how to pronounce his last name, so forgive me if I butchered it, but he has about 18k subscribers. And of course, he uploaded this video. And, uh, he also said he has proof, which you'll see here, that it is true. But some other Facebook users, such as this person, says that it's not true at all because of the coronavirus. YouTube has not made any major changes to the YouTube Partner Program monetization rules. So what we're going to do here is to watch this video and I'll probably I'll probably debunk what's been going on because well it's been up for like over 6 hours ago now by the time I'm recording this and, uh, you know, this is just like the last YouTube I, YouTuber I had to cover because another YouTuber beat up her own child. And this YouTuber, at least this time, is spreading misinformation about the YouTube Partner Program monetization changes, which hasn't been changed since 2018. All right, let's just watch. Hi, Lions. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Sorry if hindi ako energetic ngayon. Sorry if medyo pangit ang pag-edit ko sa'yo. Meron kasi akong bad news. Hindi ko alam kung paano ito sasabihin sa inyo. Maybe, meron hihilan sa inyo na alam na yung bad news na to. Hindi ito tungkol sa akin. Hindi, tungkol ito doon sa mga taong maguhan pa nung dito sa inyo. Sa mga taong hindi pa nang monetize. So way back 2015, 2016, yung requirements lang ni YouTube para ma-monetize yung channel mo is to have 10,000 views in total. At nabago yon noong 2018 yata. Nagbago siya 2018-2019. Yung requirements para ma-monetize yung channel mo is to have at least 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch hours which is yun yung naabutan ko. And since parami na nang parang yung vloggers sa buong mundo, sobrang dami na. Meron na namang bagong update, meron na namang bagong requirements, and sa tingin ko, sobrang hirap na abutin kasi times 10 eh. Parang hindi ko siya kaya para sa part ko kung hindi pa ko naman monetize until now. Feeling ko, hindi ko siya kaya abutin ng ganun na lang. Hindi ito prank, Hindi ito prank. 
this is a serious matter. I beg to differ. I mean, if it's a serious matter, then why would you mislead people like this? Why would you mislead small YouTubers for your own personal gain? Gusto ko kayong i-inform para hindi kayo ma-shop. And at the same time, gusto ko rin na maging ready kayo. So yung bagong requirements ni Google AdSense or ni YouTube para ma-monetize yung channel mo is to have 10,000 subscribers. No. No, no, not 10,000 subscribers. The YouTube Partner Program requirements is to have 1,000 subscribers. And 5,000 public watch hours. This is also false. You're only supposed to have 4,000 hours of watch time. Kailangan mong makagain ng 10,000 subscribers and 5,000 public watch hours within one year. Neither of that is true. You are only supposed to have 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 hours of watch time during in the course of 12 months. Hirap, no? Nakakawala ng gana. Ang sarap isuko. Parang ayoko nang lumaban. Pero, meron tayong good news kasi hindi pa naman siya i-implement this year, kundi next year pa, January 2021. Okay, even though I don't know what he is saying, which is why I hope to have the closed captions turned on on my YouTube video if I'm able to, but even I know that's not going to happen on January 2021. We're not even a full year yet of the, of the new era of this decade, of the year 2020. And you're spreading misinformation to people like this. Like, why? Why would you do that? Why would you create a fake post for, in, for, 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 for entertainment? Are you stupid? Ang gusto kong sabihin sa inyo is dapat ma-monetize kayo within this year. Wala namang mahirap na bagay sa mga tao na susumikap. Yung feeling na nagsusumikap ka, but at the same time, meron kang uh, faith kay God. Prayer is the best weapon dun sa mga tao uh, may pangarap. Pero I just want to cheer you up. Gusto ko na uh, magsikap kayo. Kasi wala nang sasarap kapag yung pagsisikap mo is magbuma. Nasarap mo. Tayo yung author ng sarili nating story. Tayo yung gagawa, kung ilang chapter, kailan matatapos, ano yung plot, ano yung magiging ending. So nakasalalay pa rin sa atin lahat kung ano yung magiging ending ng story natin. So siguro yung mga advice ko lang sa inyo is to become a good author so that your story will become an inspiration to other people. I am an author of my own story. And I want to make it as beautiful as I can. Oh yeah, you want to make it a beautiful story, alright? To mislead people. At gusto ko, dahil din yung gawin. Maybe this is a bad news. Pero sinasabi ko sa inyo na once na na-reach na yung pinakamahilat na situation sa buhay nyo, napakasarap sa pakiramdam. So ayun, Lions, I just want to end this vlog with this quotation. Basahin yan, be an inspiration to others, and soar high. Once again, this is Leo Marbahi. Thank you for watching. Here's his Facebook page. He has about 
3k followers and about 1,160 people liked his page and uh, this is his proof the proof that he shows that I'm going to read to you right now because I looked at it earlier and I knew something was up I just knew it. It says here on number three you have to have more than 5,000 valid public watch hours in the last 12 months starting January 1st, 2021. Four have more than than 10,000 subscribers. Five have a linked ad sense of count. The ad sense account that is linked, that might be true, but the other two are not. As you could see from someone else that I have screenshotted from, says that YouTube is not changing the monetization program at all. Which says, Updated January 2020, there are no changes to our policies or enforcement of this article update. We updated this article for clarity and to give more detail around our monetization policies for channels. If you want to join or remain the YouTube Partner Program, you will need to follow these policies. The policies in, the, in this article apply to your channel as a whole, and not just in individual videos. If you want to learn about when you can and cannot turn on ads for individual videos, you can check out our advertiser family content guidelines. And there is that. So, why the fuck did this idiot upload a misleading video about the changes to the YouTube Partner Program. And if there were changes at this time, then it would it would have been updated already. But knowing that these changes will not be made again, well, this guy, Neomar, has lied. For views. He has lied for views. Now, to all the small YouTubers out there watching this, do not fault, do not fall for his tricks. Do not fall for his lies. There are no changes to YouTube's monetization program. YouTube Partner Program, excuse me, at this time. There are no changes to that, to that and it will probably stay permanent for a while. Though one day it may change, but I doubt it might since this is their second time most likely changing the monetization rules. And so, I think that if you are having a tough time growing your own channel, just be sure to stick to those who have real information instead of those who are just giving out false information for clout. And I thought this video was, was an April Fool's joke, but apparently not since it was all uploaded about, I think seven hours ago now, by the time I uploaded this video, it might be longer than that. But, you know, that's, that's the part where I, where I draw the line, is when people like him make false statements about what YouTube is doing. 
and if you make false statements about what YouTube is doing to the YouTube partner program, then you're in big trouble. You're not supposed to mislead people. That, and it's one of those reasons why it's in the, it's probably in the YouTube community guidelines that you shouldn't be misleading people. You shouldn't mislead people with clip, clickbait or misleading titles, which Matt video could end up being one if it's not deleted. And I sure hope that if anyone's watching this doesn't fall for his tricks or anyone else's tricks. Just because YouTube might be YouTube might be out of commission for a little while and I and I do mean their support team might be might be out of commission from the headquarters for a while. So they're going to be working remotely from home. Doesn't mean that you can mess around and say some drama, gossip, fake, fake news bullshit about the YouTube partner program, which doesn't happen at all. Anyway, I'm probably going to be done here because I have to get this video. I have to like make other videos during the uh, crisis and I'm still trying to put those uh, together. So yeah. If you came from his channel because because of what it said, please know that it's not true. Please. Because YouTube did not do anything right now with these changes. They didn't announce it in April. If you see anyone like this guy who uploaded a video for for to to spread misinformation please 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 don't either don't pay attention to it or just report it to team youtube on twitter because this should not happen oh and if you could do me a favor share this video right now at least because people like him need to be stopped. And this cannot go on forever, you know. I don't want any other YouTubers who are going to spread misleading information about the YouTube Partner Program get away with it. I'm not going to let them get away with it. And neither will any other YouTube. So please. Do your part to stop the misinformation on channels like, like this, okay, please.